I am so happy I ordered another camera because I'm like, is it the lens? Is it the camera? I have another camera coming soon. I did. Oh, I showed you guys the unboxing of that other lens, which is more for like photography. Anyways, I do have a replacement vlogging camera coming soon. I I'm hoping it's that or I may have to replace this filming lens I use all the time, but at least this one is not super expensive. Anyways, um, yes. Thank you, Christina. So Okay, it shouldn't be that hot. Ooh, this thing feels sturdy. Let me just to get these for Venice for when we're in the backyard. Um, so yeah, this is nice because you can tie it to the fence. You can tie it around the tree. Now, my girlfriend had sent me a link of the one with the stake in the ground, but I was like, you know what? Since we have a gate, you know, gated fence, and then also we have a tree in the back, and I seen online where someone wrapped these around the tree. I was like, this is perfect. Um, you gotta really look at the reviews with these. I will link the one for this one specifically below because I'm real big on reviews and research. It's Amazon, it makes it easy. This seemed to be the one that was not only affordable, but really good reviews because a lot of the um, dogs were like chewing through these. I'm like, first of all, what are these? Are these dogs Cujo? Are they Jaws? Like, but I, look, my dog has destroy toys beds aggressively so you know when they get in that playful mood i know anyway super excited high hopes for this one especially with the temperatures warming up when i'm outside i don't want to you know feel like i have to be babysitting him when i'm gardening you know i just need him secure <laughs> so super excited for this and then there was a quick quick separate trip to home goods um yeah, I went in there for something and came out with something. <laughs> this was so unintentional. Oh my goodness, this is so beautiful. You guys are not going to believe. And this thing is heavy, you guys. It's solid. And I don't know exactly what this is. Definitely that looks like seashells. It kind of just gave me like beach California vibes. You guys, $5. Can you believe? And look compared at 80 and I think let's see, it looks like it was like 49 I, I, I don't understand how this happened but you guys I was just mm, so happy walking out of there so yes five can, 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 oh I, I just can't even get over it I, I'm just like taken back by this one but yes five dollars so was super excited about that you guys have to look in your clearance section in Honga and I think I'm going to put that in a family room. Although I'm even liking the way it's looking in this area. So I don't know. But then I needed a new mitten. I kind of just normally buy these pot holders mittens at um, the Dollar Tree. You know. But I was like I, I probably should go ahead and get a good one. But this one was on clearance for $4.50 for the set. And the quality is so super good. I'm like yay. Finally got a decent one. Then I got... 450 these cute little napkin holders because I'm gonna be changing the living room up gradually the dining room table and everything and furniture so yeah gonna be switching up so I love these boho looking napkin holders for when that gradually happens and then for the win needed these real bad oh, oh, okay so five dollars I feel like just so proud, proud of a good deal. Okay, five dollars. We got these. So it's a variety of the furniture things that you put at the bottom, so your furniture won't be scuffing up the wood floors. Two hundred and fourteen pieces. Then I got some Korean hot sauce that looks really good. It says we rub you, so I guess it's like a nice rub. You know what? I'm going to use these on the chicken wings I got. I am super uh, excited for this. Yeah. I love Korean food. And then lastly, I got this big thing of caramel syrup. Now, let me explain something. I used to get the one skinny girl, zero calories. I am so happy I made the connection. I don't know what the ingredient in those were causing. But over time, you guys, they were giving me horrible. Whatever that ingredient was, it was giving me horrible migraines i was never a headache person was never a migraine. i was like what is it is it pandemic fatigue you know what is causing these headaches 
what had happened was, because I probably wouldn't have gave it up. I was like, mm -mm, I don't want no extra calories in my coffee eating the regular one, you, you know, using that one. I had ran out. So I just kind of stopped using it. That was the best thing that could have happened to me because when I ran out of it, the headaches ran away. So now it's no more zero. So just keep that in mind. If you use anything, and you have to be careful because those replacement ingredients can cause more damage sometimes than the sugar. And I knew this, but for some reason, I seen that it wasn't aspartame that they used, so I thought it was okay, but no. If you are experienced migraines, experiencing, if you are experienced can I even talk? If you are experiencing, <laughs> there we go, Tiffany, slow it down, migraines and headaches out of nowhere, and you use anything sugar-free, especially these sugar-free syrups for like coffee and tea, yeah, just pull back and see what happens. I mean, I wish somebody would have shared that with me, but then actually I was watching, I'll link one of her videos below. I love her videos, Savannah Silver, or yeah, anyway, she does makeup. And um, she's an Islander, so cute. But she was saying that she was getting migraines and she stopped drinking those Coke Zeros because she's trying to get healthy. Like, I don't really drink soda, but when I do, you know, I don't want it to have sugar. And she started getting migraines. Anyway, she stopped drinking it and she stopped getting the, um, you know, migraines. So it's something as women we need to be mindful of because we're targeted with these sugar-free, no sugar, less sugar. So just keep that in mind. Okay, bye. So this lamp that was downstairs in the office, I brought it upstairs. And that is a candle holder, but it fit perfectly on top. And look, <laughs> so it matches the whole aesthetic of it all. Don't you agree? Yeah, so that worked out. For there so like you know at night it does get a little bit dark in this area so if I'm reading a book I can just turn on my light at least I know that one is working but yeah this one I'm going to look for the receipt right now because I gotta exchange you you let me down so here we go again so Chicken, oh, oh, yeah. Finger went right in. Okay, their chicken wings so good. Like their meat in general, this is for the most part where I purchase all of my meat because it's just so clean. Look at that clean, pure chicken wing. Then I got um. Every time I see my island, I get happy. I got these chicken rolls. That are really good. They're like homemade. And then I go up. Oh. Look at me. This is the life of trying to do stuff with one hand. Then I got some chicken samosas. And these are Middle Eastern style. I do like the Indian ones, but these are not Indian style. It's a twist on them. They're Middle Eastern. Oh my gosh. They're so good. So got three. And three for me and my daughter. Guess we'll have that later with some coffee. In fact, I'm about to make coffee right now. It's 9.51. And I normally have my coffee around 10, 10.30. And it is needed. So yeah, going to make some coffee right now. So I was in Dollar Tree yesterday. And I just, I think I may have shared this. Yeah, I shared this with you guys. How I love black Sharpie markers for different hats. You can use it on black furniture. You can use it on, you know, black clothing, leather, what have you. So the last time I used a Sharpie, and I'll show you, I used it on my Adidas jacket because why did I paint with my Adidas jacket? Like why? Anyways, paint got on there, so it was black. So I said black on black. The Sharpie didn't really do it this time. So then this said Vivid um, Permanent Waterproof Ink. So I said, yeah, since this is Vivid, we're going to try this big one and see if that's promising. Then I got some cards, like all-purpose cards. I didn't need them to say thank you. I didn't need I just needed blank cards. And I just thought these were so pretty. Look at these. So pretty. Then I got some scotch tape, which is always needed for Amazon packages with the label. I got some Glad Ziploc bags. I like to keep these on point. Then, oh, and let me show you. These are like tree snacks for the kizzos. 
Then I had to exchange the bulb, the one that was in the 25 watt, for the upstairs lamp that I'm going to use at my makeup gal um, vanity. Yeah, I had to exchange because I needed Type B. So pick these up, and these are pretty bright. So yeah, hopefully these work. Then, and lastly, over here, this just came yesterday. So my favorite salad dressing, and I have another bottle. I'm just, I don't feel like dealing with it. But this is, uh, can we focus? Trader Joe's. I mean, I mean. <laughs> this is funny. Anyways, it was gone. So I mixed it with a little bit of water, but it got too runny. But I love to use this. It's like dipping sauce. There we go. Even with chicken wings. So good. Get this from Trader Joe's. I think it's like $2.69, but I don't know if I like how this looks. Let me just open another bottle. So over this camera playing me. Anyways, it's whole Greek yogurt, um, gluten-free granola, blueberries, shredded coconut, um, dry cranberries, um, blueberries, and a little bit of chia seeds sprinkled on top, and some honey drizzle. But yeah, getting ready to eat this as I do my makeup. Getting ready. I'm getting ready to record a wig review. I have not done one in a very long time, so... Just going to put on a little bit of makeup, hurry up and get this done, and yeah, yummers. This little guy got a haircut yesterday. Yes, she looks so handsome. Strag, she's just waking up. I should have got you when you first got your haircut. I love how it looks like he got a little blowout. Well, I guess he did. All groomed. He's pretty um, dramatic, so every time he goes to see the groomers, it takes him like a day or two to get himself back together. I don't know if he just thinks I'm not coming back to pick him up, or if it's just the washing, hearing the loud blow dryer, the clipping, maybe just everything. It stresses him out, so he's going to need a couple of days. Right, buddy? You're okay. You're home now. Anyways, getting ready to make a cheese board for my friend's anniversary. Should I film it? Maybe I will. Well, I don't know. You guys, we don't feel like setting up and filming. I'll just record the aftermath and show everything that I used. I mm add -hmm. white omelet. So right now I'm sauteing my onion. I'm gonna add in mushroom, a little bit of tomato, spinach, turkey, American yellow cheese. I already took my portion off, but oh my goodness, you guys, so good. Turned out so yummers. So yes, you guys, it's already packaged because I forgot to get video footage, but I did take plenty of, I will insert pics of how it It turned out turned out amazing though love the way it's packaged and she'll be picking it up soon so when I went back to home goods to exchange the lamp I found some more stuff on clearance <laughs> well not this thing but it's such a good price I think they have the best 
cutest like plant holders for super cheap. It was only $9.99. Yellow is my happy color. This was on clearance. Sunshine and good feelings. Total California vibes I'm getting from this. Three dollars. That cute. Three dollars. Super excited for that. And then coffee and friends are the perfect blend. So this is distracting. <laughs> Let me open it. And you can put like little sugars or I don't know. I'm thinking different like packets of sugars or when your friends come by. Three dollars. Then without coffee, literally I can't. True story. My true life. Remember that on MTV? Four dollars fifty cents. So yes, check your home goods, Marshall's. The cutest coffee cups ever. Rise and grind. It's nice and big too. Five ninety nine. And comp, oh, comp, cup of comfort. I got this for more so tea. So yeah, cup of comfort. So cute. Both five ninety nine. So I got this one for tea when you're in that comfort mood. And then of course for morning and spell. So yeah. Then I got. Let me put this down. Yes. Wait. So let me explain. I was in Home Goods a while back, and I think somebody I feel like they had returned one. I was like, no, you know what? I'm not gonna do it. I was like, don't do it, girl. I'm happy I didn't, you guys, because fifteen dollars. I got this for my bed bedroom, and when I tell you these, it's super thick. It doesn't really look at look like it, but it's super thick. And I found two. On Clarence the brand is habitat decor since 2012 but oh my goodness matches my room perfect giving me all type of boho vibes so yep was super duper excited with those finds so this completes like my bedroom so look out I'm going to do a bedroom tour coming up really quick and then I'm gonna update my daughters because I feel like the first that vintage Paris video um I did a voiceover I won't be doing that for a while because my computer was so loud and it was annoying the heck out of me so until I can figure that out no so I'm just gonna do it over a whole walkthrough talk through type of thing and then I have updated a few items in her room um which I showed you guys one of those things so yeah look out for those two videos coming up but my bedroom tour will be coming up before hers and hers would just be like a revised I guess. But yeah, it'll be coming up soon. Little coffee station. So this is where I put this for now. I have to take the tab off. It's like a complete eyesore. You know what? And this is bothering me too. Yeah, the syrup is an eyesore too. You know what? I'm probably going to have to transfer that into another bottle because it's getting on my nerve. But yes, this right here is a whole vibe. I also had to move this over here. Sorry, that's the neighbor with his loud car. Um, you know, young people. But, um, yeah. I'm loving it. Remember, this is the Target. I'll link that video where I talked about my little Target finds and everything. But, yes, it have come together. I'm not putting, no, this is it. This is where we are done. Nothing else. Yeah, exactly. All right. Right here. So cute. Loving it. Right there. It's like super perfect. And I'm going to repot that one soon. But do you see? Do you see what I see? This baby is growing like crazy, so it's kind of covering it, but you know. So, yes. So, this person package came to our home. 
It was really weird because our address, but not our names. I'm like, who is this? So I tried to even look the person up in hopes of, you know, delivering it to their house, like mix up things happen all the time. Well, the person wasn't even coming up in this state. And so then I decided just to call the company, which is Paula's Choice. And I was like, look, this person's package has come to my home. You know, I don't know who this is. So there's like, give me the name. And it was like, you know what? This was an error. Somehow, you know, this package accidentally got sent to you. We're going to correct it and send the customer out a new package. And you can go ahead and keep that. They said it's like a discoloration serum. But if you don't have any use for that, you can pass it on, donate it. I'm like, uh, yeah, I can use that. So I don't know the deets on it. I really, I think I've heard of this company, but isn't that cool? It pays to be honest because now I get to try a free serum. So super excited. So I'm clearing some stuff out of the garage and I'm like, whoop, whoop. <laughs> Just in time for Super Bowl Sunday. Today is Thursday and it's this Sunday. So I was like, oh my goodness, this is from not even last year, before the pandemic, BC, before COVID. <laughs> so it's the football cups, you know, black cups. I have these black and white. I don't even know. First of all, we're just doing like a Zoom Super Bowl thing. I might end up having a few over. I don't even know yet, but it's kind of cool that I found it because I'm just working with what I have already, including if I pull a food out, it's gonna be what's already in there. I do have like chicken wings that I brought that I can make yeah it would have to be worked out with what's here so this is what i'm working with and i would say this is about all i need and i have plenty of civil where i have all kind of like party themed stuff in a garage so just organizing sorting through that stuff right now quick, quick makeup look Zoom bridal shower, but make it fun. So hungry. It's like after three and I have not had anything but coffee. I'm down on a Saturday. Bean for Super Bowl Sunday. So I used this jerk Jamaican style marinade sauce. And then I also used this Nashville hot chicken seasoning. It has cumin in there, oregano, a little bit of brown sugar and vinegar. Also used some garlic salt with parsley and black pepper. So I'm just gonna let this marinade in the refrigerator. Then I'm going to use some gluten-free flour. And I'm going to put this in the air fryer because I've really been enjoying wings in the air fryer. And then you don't have to worry about all the oil and your cholesterol and all of that stuff because it's healthier using the air fryer. So yes, gonna let, let these marinate. And I guess in a few, I'm gonna get started on a cheese board. It's gonna be very, I mean, we're doing a Super Bowl Zoom from home. So I'm just gonna have wings. I'm gonna make the gluten-free barbecue chicken pizza, the California pizza that I brought. And then the cheese board, and that's basically about it. <laughs> that's, that's it, you know? Keeping it super simple, baby. So I'm gonna let these marinate. Here is my yummy looking cheese board. Love the way it turned out. Cherries, grapes, blueberries, olives. I love these wasabi almonds. Get them from Aldi, so good. Some smoked gouda, some smoked white cheddar. All done. Wings are in the air fryer. I'm getting ready to put this baby in the oven. Gluten free. This is my favorite pizza from California Pizza Kitchen. And I'm so happy it's gluten free now. Well, at least they make one gluten-free. Not only that, it is natural chicken raised without added hormones. So, 
yeah, super excited for this. My little quick Zoom Super Bowl setup. I think it turned out pretty cute. Put the wings in there. Put my son cheese crackers in that bowl. And the cheese platter is already together. So if I was thinking I have a few more of these, I would have put the cheese platter in there. That would have been cute. But the wings would be cute in there too. Yep, that's our quick little scribble setup.